Good morning, everybody. Today is Saturday, April 3rd, 2021. Week what? Up? I don't, I, where, where, where? 122. <laughs> He's slacking today. I know. It's usually on the cheat sheet on the laptop here, and I you scrambled it all. It's my fault. Anyway, I was 335 last week. This week, I'm 335.6. I'm up six, and, uh, you know, I'm praying. <laughs> if you notice, stacy has got a little shiner. Oh. On her cheek. Yeah. It wasn't me. <laughs> it's an oral surgeon. She had a bad tooth. She had to get removed. And then they started a bone graft. And then they're going to put an implant in eventually after the bone graft heals up. Or what does that take? Like two months or a month and a half? Yeah, a couple of months. I go back in three weeks. I have stitches in my mouth. Um, the stitches are touching my tongue and they're touching my cheek. Well, the one good thing is you're wearing a mask these days. So the mask kind of covers the cheek and the swelling and the... It does. So that's good. It yeah. does. I've been putting ice on it, but the swelling has finally gone down for the most part, but I'm still pretty dang sore. Um, for those that are here for the update, what's your weight? Oh. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I got my name right away. That's what she said. Oh. I never know what's going to come out of his mouth. Last week I weighed in at 142. Uh, this week I weighed in at 141.4, so 0.6 down versus hmm. even. So you lost the 0. 0.6 and I found the 0. 0.6. That's what happened. <laughs> That's what happened, yes. That's the way it works. <laughs> All right, so there's nothing else on the sheet, right? No. Nope. No? Nope. Hey, this week we worked on our bed platform for the camper van, and we got a video out for that, so that was pretty cool. Yes. Turned out really nice, uh, very functional. You can move it all the way back to the back when you don't need it, and you can move it all the way to the front when you need to sleep on it. Mm -hmm. Worked out pretty well. So if you hadn't seen that video and you want to check it out, go it's to the little link. It's pretty fun. We had some fun little one snippets more in there. Yeah, one more step closer to, uh, yeah, we went to Ikea, and then we went to Home Depot, and we cheated. We had them cut a lot of the major pieces of wood for us. But they do that really cheap and free. A couple first cuts are free, mm -hmm. a couple two cuts free, and then like 50 cents a cut after that. So Why not let them use their big saws and go clip, clip, you know, tell them what you need. So yeah. that worked out really well. And then, um, yeah, we came home and tried to put it all together. And then we even tried to make it look nice. We found some paint that was <laughs> super cheap, like 99 cents for these sample jars. Yeah. Had them tinted black. And then we found some cheap carpet. At, I wouldn't even say cheap carpet, but it was inexpensive carpet. It was, on, it was on coupon at Costco. At Costco. And we bought that and covered everything so that when we put these platforms in and out, we don't scratch up our car, like the interior, and we don't get, and splinters. We don't get splinters. Yeah, so we have everything carpeted. So it looks really nice, and it's very functional for us. Yes. And uh, and, and it's so comfortable. Mm -hmm. We both laid out there in the van on that six inches of foam and just kind of said, man, this is like rivals a bed in the house. It yeah. doesn't feel like you're on a cot. doesn't feel like you're on an air mattress. Very, very comfortable. So, it is. It is. So that's going to make going on a trip more in our rocket ship <laughs> yeah no it's gonna make it more comfortable and, yeah yeah so we're still working on that van gonna get it ready my mm -hmm. first trip's gonna be in uh april yeah well the, the, this, this, month. this month yeah couple about weeks. in a couple weeks so i've got to get continually working on that try and get everything else ready got a little bit of a kitchen got a little bit mm -hmm. of a bathroom set up yeah. Got a little bit for an emergency if you had to go. Right. I'd rather just stop somewhere and use their <laughs> bathroom. And uh, yeah, I think now it's just like the odds and the ends and the incidentals. Mm -hmm. Put things together and make a video. Yeah. And have fun. And go on an adventure. Uh, yeah, an adventure that will be super fun. And then he has another one set for May. May. Going to go out and, and see my sister and my mm -hmm. good buddy Steve out in Wyoming and Colorado. Yeah. And there's a potential I might be down in Albuquerque and seeing Stacy if she goes down there at the yeah. May. Well, I am that going down there. I'll be down there uh, at the end of May. It just depends on our schedules, depending on if we can meet up at the same time on the road, you know. Having and, our daughter come, our oldest daughter coming home. Yeah, and, we've, we've got some schedules to arrange for our youngest daughter, whether she'll be able to stay with Lauren, our older daughter. Or whether we have to take her with us, and she does not want to go with me in the car. She does not want to fly with Stacy in the airplane. Um, so we're trying to see if we can find family or friends that would 
host her for a few days so that I can actually, I'll be in Colorado, you'll be in yeah. Albuquerque, and if we can have somebody watch Julia, I can drive down to Albuquerque, pick you up, and then we can travel home together, yeah. which would be really fun. It would be. Yeah. So we'll see, and then we've got some uh, short trips planned, um, some local trips to um, campgrounds and stuff. campgrounds and things here in Michigan. So That'll it's going to be fun. It'll be it'll be really nice. I don't know that Julia is loving to wanting to partake in <laughs> the camping yeah. portion of it. No, she's not into when that. When we went to the um, cabin, she was like, uh, kind of thought it was kind of neat for like a hot second, and then she's like, when are we going home? I want to go home. <laughs> Yeah, Stacy's got some stuff going on with work that uh, I'm congratulating for her on. She's just accepted a position as... I'm going to go uh, to back to the front end as a cashier. Um, so that'll be super nice and, uh, you know, something different. It'll she be... likes being, working with the people like that. Yeah, I like working with people um, on a more so everyday, all-day basis versus... Um, not okay uh, i'll get rid of some some freedoms you know um uh, being in maintenance i'm all over and everywhere but there are a lot of things in maintenance that i won't miss either scrubbing <laughs> floors scrubbing. and scrubbing the bottoms of things and yep. bathrooms and whatever else so the spills yesterday was a big spill day i must have cleaned up five bottles of wine that were spilled on the floor it's, it's hmm. what are you doing that you're just like dropping the wine out of your cart <laughs> just happens. It just happens. And you know that floor, it's just smash. And it's not even just like it, it was in the laundry detergent aisle. One was in the foods aisle I get, but it's just, it's weird. So um, at least it smells good. I don't drink. I don't like wine, but it smells good. Most hmm. of them, there are some, but I have to clean up the vodka. Oof. Oh, that's, that's like a cleaning agent or something, <laughs> you know. People are like, yeah. oh, let me get my straw. And I'm like, oh, that's so gross. <laughs> Yeah, but neither of us drink or smoke or any of that. So, yeah, it's just, it's a foreign thing to me. Exactly. So, I don't know. I'm too cheap. I got other things I want to buy and spend money on. Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but let's see what else. Uh, oh, and we have Stacy surgery coming up on the 7th. So we are doing everything we can to just uh, try and stay positive. And mm -hmm. keep thinking positive thoughts. And the waiting can just chew you up and eat you up. Yeah. So we are trying to keep busy with projects and just know that each day that passes is one day closer to getting the answers we need. Yes. And hopefully all these things come back as benign and uh, we can move forward and get them out of you and make you feel better. Mm -hmm. And uh, less Thank anxiety. Thank you guys all for your support. Um, it was a little overwhelming and... All the messages that we got, and um, yeah, it's, it's been, much appreciated. It's been some crazy couple of weeks here. We haven't been able to focus on much of anything. So I've I've truly got a phone list on my phone, and uh, I every morning I'm looking at that list, saying what can I accomplish today, mm -hmm. instead of just letting things just consume me. And you know, what yeah. can I do about that except for just pray and move forward and try and be productive? So that's what we're trying to do. Um, mm -hmm. Some days are better than others. A little bit of sleep here and there. I think it's going to be a lot better after the seventh. Well, after the results of the seventh. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't know if it takes a couple of days or a week or you know what. Hopefully they'll expedite it and you'll know soon. So at this point, that's where we're at. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yep. No. <laughs> I haven't done my yeps in a while. You have, have I? not. No. Yep. Yeah. So, so that's where we're at, guys. Um, I, oh, last week we talked about the Wendy's chicken sandwich and the recipe. Aww. Well, I was going to do a dry run, and I did do a dry run, and we actually were making some chicken. Long story short, I did everything that I saw them doing and kind of made my own uh, interpretation of what they were doing and I was following everything was the same except for I used almond flour versus regular flour because mm -hmm. I was trying to make it keto and it was the most disgusting thing <laughs> I couldn't even keep it in my mouth I went right to the garbage can and spit it out it was horrible true story I tried it like four different times because I thought well maybe I just got a bad mix of the seasonings right here let me try this other little corner of this other piece 
every single, I mean, for like a half hour, I was just drinking water and like spitting stuff out. It was horrible. I would never, in and fact, I could have made a comedy video of us trying to do it, but it was, it was so beyond horrible that I, mm. and it was the day that I had all this done. So all my mouth was really sore and I was trying not to laugh because mm -hmm. my jaw was killing me. I'm glad I can amuse you like a clown. <laughs> you did. I, like I'm a you clown here to amuse you. Frank's hot sauce. It doesn't do well. He he was like. I was <laughs> red. <laughs> I was beet red. I know I was. His sister was here and we were both like trying not to laugh, but it was. It was funny. It was funny. <laughs> but it just, you know, the reason I didn't put something out for that, because I was really excited about doing it for us because I know you really enjoyed those. Right. It was so beyond horrible that I literally couldn't even chew it and keep it in my mouth. I had to go right to the garbage and spit it out and then like take water and spit that out. And oh, it was horrible, horrible, horrible. I couldn't get the taste out of my mouth. I tried pop. I tried um, coffee, milk. A milk. Um, I could not get that horrible taste out of my mouth. And I don't know what I did wrong because I was literally following the spices, literally following the flouring and frank sauce. Uh, you get it in Frank sauce, you do it in the flour, you put it in Frank sauce, you put it back in the flour. I was doing exactly how they did it on TV, kind of following the hints of what they said. And um, it was horrible. So I, I guess that's just not happening. I don't even <laughs> want to try it again because I don't, even want, I don't know what I did wrong that I could fix. So I'm like, you know what? We're just not having a was, spicy chicken sandwich. I think it was the Frank's hot sauce. Yeah. You know, I don't mind hot, but there are some things that when they're hot, they just taste burnt. Yeah, um, I get that. So I understand that that comment because yeah, hot and burnt are two different tastes yeah. to me. Smoky yes. is another taste that's different. Yeah, when you get to like a barbecue sauce and it's too smoky, it's like ah, it doesn't work for me. I'm more one of those. What is it? Southern sweet. Because there's different regions that have different. I oh. think it's I think it's southern that was sweet. I might be wrong. But uh, yeah, some of them are probably some of them are sweeter than others, and I kind of prefer that sweet. I don't know. I'm a <laughs> dork. Well, hey guys, have a great weekend, and I hope if you are on your keto journey that you did better than us this week because I did horrible. Point six up. <sighs> yeah, and for Not those that it. celebrate Easter, happy Easter. Ba -ba -ba -ba. <laughs> Thank you, Easter Bunny. Ba -ba -ba. We're the the like us. 30 and under crowd are like, what are you talking about? Right. And everybody over 30, you get it. You get it. <laughs> <laughs> That's just the way that works. But anyway, hope everybody has a great week. And uh, I'm hoping when we come back next week, because it'll be past, it'll be the 10th, right? Yes. Yeah, seven more days. So uh, maybe we'll even have some info. I, I would love to be able to give some info by that point, point Yeah. on how you're doing. And maybe your jaw will be feeling better. Yeah. Did that bone graft, so oh. um, the extraction gave you that nice little shiner there. Yeah, gosh, it's so sore, even, like, touching it. Everybody's going to think I clocked you or something. Like I said, good thing for, for a mask. Um, yeah, yeah, that Because you everything. can't see anything, because, you know, all you see is just my eyes. Yeah. So that's one time that I'm thankful for the mask, and uh, they were joking at work. pain for you, too. Yeah, yeah, it's it's... And it goes all the way down. But you know what? Now you don't have the tooth pain anymore. And when we get past the bone graft and you put the implant in, you'll just feel randy dandy. Yeah. Great. You know, no more pain. No more pain. That's the way to look at it. No more pain. No more pain. No more pain. So I'm going to do it again. I'm going to say, okay, guys, everybody have a great week. And um, <laughs> we'll see you soon. <laughs> and uh, if I can think of something that isn't horrible like the Wendy's chicken sandwich, maybe we'll get another video out. Or maybe we'll do a live stream this week. Yeah. We do a live stream and I put it out there and sometimes we get like a half dozen people in there. I kind of feel silly. But yeah, ask us anything or just chit chat a little mm -hmm. bit of anything and everything. Sounds maybe we'll like do it from the van. Live stream from the van. Oh, yeah. That'd be kind of neat. Just like, here's what we've done so far. I just made some blackout curtains. That's going to be cool. Yeah. So like behind the driver's and passenger seat, we'll have like a little tension rod bar and then with a little uh, blackout curtains to keep the inside nice and dark because Stacy made all these wonderful window covers for the inside. Mm -hmm. So now you have all that privacy and darkness if you want to try and sleep. Doesn't matter if it's day or night. <laughs>
All right. I'm doing it for the third time. Goodbye. Have a great weekend. And we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Bye.